It's your girl, Miss Two Vs, and I'm with Dreezy at the 25th Annual Essence Festival. How you feeling today? I feel good, girl. I'm so glad to see all these black people out mm -hmm. here looking good in their different colors and stuff. It's real good. We are out here celebrating black excellence, mm -hmm. black girl magic. Yes. What does black girl magic mean to you? I mean, black girl magic is everything. Mm -hmm. I feel like most importantly is confidence. Um, it's just, it's of course melanin. Just being just who you are, just loving the skin that you're in. That's black, black magic. Like not letting what people or the stereotypes that people put on our skin song stop us from being successful and the women mm -hmm. that we are. Speaking of Black Girl Magic, congratulations on your recent project that Thank was just you. released. Can you tell me about the process of creating that? Yeah, I mean, I'm always in the studio, just in and out. Mm -hmm. So, like, this year was, like, a real rough for me, rough time for me because I didn't have no manager. I didn't have nobody in the studio with me. I was just creating and just trying different sounds, and I put it out, and I, I feel like my fans responded to it super good because I only shot one video to it, Chanel Slides. Right, um, and that one was it's, crazy. It's going, it's popping. <laughs> me and Jacquees shot another video to love someone. It hasn't dropped yet, but I'm going to drop it. So I'm still kind of like itching it out. You have a release date for those visuals? I don't or you know. still working on I, it? I was still working on it because it's going to be like heavy on the visual effects. Mm -hmm. You know, so it needed some time to get edited and everything. So I wanted it to be perfect. Mm -hmm. And I'm working on new music. We got some new music we made. I got a lot of dope stuff on the way so yeah right now the beats movie is out i don't know if you've seen it i have not got the chance yeah. i do not watch tv you gotta but i gotta sit out. down and yeah. it's on netflix right uh-huh yeah so it's real easy just go on netflix it's right there anthony anderson davies that's like i've been doing a lot of acting and stuff so is that something that you've always been passionate about <laughs> no but like i said I don't, i'm still looking for the right manager for me that can really you know, do treat my music the way I wanted it to be treated. So I'm taking my time with my music, but on the other hand, I'm getting more opportunities in other ways. So I'm just, I'm not knocking nothing. I'm trying everything. As you should, yeah. girl. Go ahead. Congratulations mm -hmm. again. Thank you. Thank you. So do you write all your own raps? Hell yeah. Yes. How yeah. important as a female rapper is it for you to write your own raps? Um... To be honest, now in music, I don't think it's that important. Clearly, I see To the saying. people, mm -hmm. you know, and those are the people that's going to buy it and support your music. So, I feel like, for myself, I always want to stay, push my pen so I can stay just smart with my pen game. And, mm -hmm. and even if I do work with writers, because I don't have writers touch my verses, but even if I work with them on, like, the hook or the bridge or yeah. something like that, I always want to still be able to go in and be myself. You know, I don't want people just talking for me. I, I got to be able to use my own words. So I think it's important to have the skill, but not necessarily, like, to be successful. Not really, not nowadays. Definitely not, <laughs> as we can see nowadays. It's almost like having a ghostwriter, that's almost the quickest way to pop out. So, it's not bad, I'm not knocking it, but I personally can push my band. So. Well, we all know that you're off the market right now, but how you feel about the City Girls, Hot Girls wave going on? Oh, girl, you can still be a hot girl in and out of a relationship, you know? When yes. you, when you're a hot-ass bitch, period. Mm -hmm. Everywhere you go, you just start a fire. So, I feel like... You know, even Young Miami, I see she pregnant right now. She's still a hot bitch. She out here getting that bag. Period. And doing it with a child, like, that make you even more of a boss to right. me. So, yeah, it's a hot girl summer. It's hot as hell. <laughs> <laughs> and what can your fans expect from you? Like, you have any new... Oh. Any new music or yeah. you just gonna ride out with this? Ride? Well, no, nah, I'm working on my next album, so that's Already. definitely what I'm focused on right now. I'm I'm trying to put it out this year, but if not, if I want it to be perfect, I might put it out next year. But other than that, I just signed a deal with Puma. Nice, um, congrats. So thank you, so I'm the ambassador for that. And I got some other brand deals that's coming on the way this year, so I'm excited to announce that. The acting's still popping, and the music is working. It's in the works. We got Secure a lot of that bag, big features sis. on the way. Yep. <laughs> and closing out, Nikki recently defended herself. You know, basically just defending her throne and let mm -hmm. people know that she has been showing love. And love so many. Yeah, I love Nikki, and I think that anybody that works hard in whatever field they in has the right to speak their piece, especially if they feel like they getting treated unfairly or mm -hmm. not getting the credit that they're giving. Mm -hmm. 
And at the same time, I feel like, fuck these people. You know, you can't please everybody. Even if you could be at the top of your game, at the top of the mountain, people still going to try to find stones to throw at you. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Beyonce still get tired. It's like the greats. That's what makes you great, though, when people are talking about you and you're the topic of the conversation. So, shout out to Nikki. She has been holding it down for over 10 years. Yeah. Still holding it down. Yes. And I see her working with Trina and all the up-and-coming rappers. So, that's dope. Like, I think she's doing her thing. Always. Thank you so much, Dreezy. It's been Thank a pleasure. You. Thanks, Kathy. <laughs>